Hi, this is Deacon Larry, and this is Renewed. Welcome back to Renewed. Kelly, when we were together last time, we were talking about those three moments in the adoration, the exposition, the adoration, and benediction of the Blessed Sacrament. And I understand you have a follow-up question. I do. So during adoration or during the exposition and benediction as well, there's certain vestments the priest or deacon wear that you don't usually see in Mass or in other, say, devices like the mm -hmm. monstrance that we don't see come out as frequently. Can you talk about the, the particulars that go on during adoration. Sure, during adoration, one of the things that the priest or the deacon typically are not vested in a chasuble. That's the vestment of the priest that he wears at mass, right? And the chasuble means little house. It's the little house, as it were. It's actually reflective of an old Ro ancient Roman dress that uh, men wore. Also, the deacon typically wears a dalmatic, again, dating back to the ancient Roman clothing. But we don't wear those typically at adoration. The priest typically will be in an alb, that's that white baptismal garment that he uh, typically wears and his stole, but with him will wear then what's called a cope, and a cope is simply a covering. It acknowledges reverence. The reason he, that uh, a cope is used is the vestment, the chasuble is used for the Eucharistic liturgy. So if it's not happening in the Eucharistic liturgy, then you wear a cope. In fact, if you notice on Good Friday, Father doesn't wear a chasuble for Mass. What he wears is a coat. It's, it's not the Mass, it's the celebration of the Lord's Passion, but we don't have the consecration of the Eucharist. So you'll see him very often vested in a red coat. That's what's called for in the liturgy of a Good Friday. So the cope is there as a vestment for this moment outside of Mass, and you'll, oftentimes you'll see him slip his hands into the little pockets in the cope so as not to touch the monstrance. Again, it's just an extra sign of reverence. It's entirely okay to touch the monstrance and to lift the monstrance with your hand in order to do the benediction, but it often enhances the reverence by showing that, that uh, we don't touch directly. So it's a little bit of an, of an extra, as it were, but not a requirement. And so very often you'll see if someone has copes and they're, again, with vestments, sometimes it's, do we have all the liturgical colors for the copes that we want to use and those kinds of questions. And so in some places it's simpler just to wear your album stole and uh, do adoration benediction. Or in other times, it's wonderful to wear the coat because it adds a little reverence to the moment. And we hope your time in adoration, exposition, adoration, benediction, will lead you to be renewed. Please like, subscribe, or comment below.